Honourable Minister, um, Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, um, I'd like to uh, present the greetings of the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Belgium, the Vice Prime Minister, Minister of Foreign Affairs, who due to uh, obligations in the framework of EU presidency and domestic policy um, was unable to attend today. Um, I'd like to welcome you to this conference. It's a great thing that it takes place. And I also would like to welcome Minister Baish to uh, Belgium. And I would like to extend to him on this occasion also Ibai Ramlar for the Kurban Bayram that is taking place at this moment currently. And to all Muslim uh, brothers and sisters who are here in our midst. Um, the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Belgium meets uh, Minister Baish quite regularly. Uh, both bilaterally in connection with uh, Turkish succession talks, as it has already been uh, said before. Uh, last meetings were taking place in August and in October, both in Istanbul. This conference, for one, sends actually an important message of bridging, that a lot of groundwork is underway in Turkey. We heard, we witnessed all what uh, Minister Baş was saying, we also witnessed what has been said before by others, and that is probably going to be repeated, that there is still a lot to be done, that things are not perfect, but Mr. Baish himself has already said that too, that actually things are not uh, uh, perfect at this moment. But I would like to make one uh, important remark that uh, uh, we picked up from a visit that we made in August to Istanbul and to, Ank and to Ankara. Our minister and our group met with uh, the ecumenical patriarch uh, Bartholomeus and other religious leaders in Turkey during uh, the recent visit that we made in August to Istanbul. And the minister distinctly noticed an upbeat atmosphere of constructive cooperation involving those leaders, those religious leaders of the different, the different religious groups in Turkey, their communities and Turkish authorities. The participation of, Mr. Baish, of Minister Baish in today's conference itself underscores the setting of dialogue and goodwill to the benefit of religious and philosophical freedom, to the benefit of Turkish society for itself, and to the, ter and to the benefit of Europe. For Belgium too, that is important. First, because of the intrinsic values of diversity and respect in religious and philosophical approaches to life. Second, because Belgium considers itself as a close and privileged partner of Turkey, linked also by the presence of a large Turkish community that is harmoniously living in Belgium, in diversity, contributing to our country, and basically an important component of diversity, as I said before. Many thanks, Mr. Minister. Many thanks, everybody, to be here today. A warm greeting of our Minister of Foreign Affairs, who unfortunately could not attend himself. Thank you very much.